All right, now I want to uh, go into the um, uh, self-defense uh, portion with the ass, uh, utilizing the five angles of attack. Now, in the combat sequeras non esgrima, there are 12 angles of attack in which Grandmaster Angel Cabales had taught me. Now, he said, in all situations, no matter what, any attack will fall in one of those 12 angles of attack. But what I'm going to demonstrate here primarily is just the first five, which in the Philippines we call cinco tero, meaning the five angles of attack. Okay? Now, the first attack, which is very common, is the overhead strike, which we call this the number one angle of attack, shooting to this side of the body towards the collarbone. The next one is like a backhand, which is the second, number two, angle of attack, okay, to the opposite collarbone. The third one is to the ribs, to the left side of the ribs, using a side swinging motion, okay. The fourth is the opposite side of, of the body, same uh, rib, uh, contact with the rib area again with the same swinging motion. Okay, then the fifth is a thrust to the abdomen or center part of the body. Okay, so we have one, two, three, four, five. Okay, now these are all in uh, the uh, left inside of the body and so one attack can be all in one motion. Okay? Now, with uh, one of the weapons that uh, can be found in CDC uh, is, the, is the cleaver uh, or any kind of knife uh, can be used in central kitchen. Now, what I'm going to demonstrate on this one is the number one attack coming with the overhand strike to the side of this body here, whether it be to the neck or to the collarbone, doesn't matter, it's on this side. Okay, now the next one is a piece of board. This one has a nail on it. And again, inmates can break this off uh, anywhere that, uh, you know, would be found and using it against an officer. This will be the second strike using either the overhand or holding it double, striking to the opposite side of the body. Again, it doesn't matter to the neck or to the collarbone, it doesn't matter. It's on this side of the body. That's what we're concentrating on, okay? Next one is the shovel. Main yard, they use this. Agriculture, they use this. Inmates get a hold of this, and they can use this as a swinging. What we're going to do is the third angle of attack, using a swinging motion. Okay? And then the fourth is the chain. Okay? Plan ops, I'm sure they have chains in there. And then we're going to use this as also a swinging motion on the opposite side using the number four angle of attack, okay? So, like so, on this side of the body. And final one is, is a pick or homemade shank. Uh, can be made out of almost anything. Piece of metal, as long as it's got the tip, be thicker, shorter, smaller, longer, doesn't matter. It's still in the same idea, the shank. Okay, this will be the number five, thrusting to the abdomen. All right, so there you have it. We have the one, two, three, four, five. And we're going to use different weapons for the angles of attack.